What's going on, Aces? Welcome back to the channel. So Cardi B is pregnant with her third child, and I want to send congratulations to her, right? The expecting mother. I wanted to make a separate video from her divorce announcement because one, she did it that way, right? She announced her pregnancy separately from her announcing or filing divorce from, from Offset. But also, I feel like you know, children are a blessing. They are a reward from the Lord. That's what it says in the Bible. And I feel like even though she is divorcing her philandering husband, her third child is going to be, you know, a bundle of joy. And she dedicated this post specifically to highlight that. So NBC News writes that Cardi B is expecting her third child the Grammy award-winning rapper revealed her pregnancy in an Instagram post Thursday, cradling her belly and gazing down at it. In two photos, she shared to her page. The social media announcement came shortly after she filed for divorce from rapper Offset. She says, quote, with every ending comes a new beginning. I am so grateful to have shared this season with you. You have brought me more love, more life, and most of all, renewed my power. Cardi B, who's 31, wrote in her caption. She says, reminded me that I can have it all. You've reminded me that I've never had to choose between life, love, and my passion. I love you so much and cannot wait for you to witness what you helped me accomplish, what you pushed me to do. It's so much easier taking life's twists, turns, and tests, laying down. But you, your brother, and your sister have shown me why it's worth it to push through. So Cardi B and Offset, who got married in 2017, have two children, six-year-old daughter Culture and two-year-old son Wave. Their divorce was not based on any one particular incident, it has been a long time coming and it is amicable, a representative for Cardi B said in a statement on Thursday. So Cardi B, she filed for divorce before, from Offset in 2020, before the couple decided to reunite. The rapper has often expressed affection for her children on social media, sharing pictures and celebrating their milestones on Instagram. Last month, she was a happy birthday to her beautiful, gentle, and amazing daughter, writing on an Instagram post that she has been growing up with you because I learned so much just by being your mom. The pregnancy news drew a wave of support from fans who flooded her comments with congratulations and well wishes. She says it's, um, they're just reiterating what she put on, on the post about pushing through with her children. And I just want to say that, you know, I feel like this is definitely a positive thing that comes out of, you know, the marriage between Cardi B and Offset. Unfortunately, I feel like Offset is going to, again, realize um, just the weight of what he lost if Cardi does decide to go through with this divorce. That realization is going to come a little bit later in life. And it's going to hit him really hard, but that's often what happens, you know, with men when they choose to seek pleasure and, you know, hedonism over their own marriage and obligations as a father. Um, but who knows, you know, maybe Cardi can find love somewhere else. I'm sure that she probably will. And maybe Offset will do the same and they can co-parent. You know, they said that the split was amicable. So maybe they can have that same amicable relationship when it comes to co-parenting their children. Those children need both parents. You know what I mean? I mean, I know that some people say, I mean, of course you can raise children by yourself if you absolutely have, have to. And Cardi is seeking primary custody. Um, so she must not have faith in Offset's parenting abilities, unfortunately. Um, now keep you posted on whether she, you know, gains primary custody or not. But I understand what she's saying. Like, if he doesn't have 
the character and strength enough to have, you know, the integrity as a husband to stay within their marriage, then that spills over, unfortunately, to how you parent your children. And you don't want to set that example for your children, right? You don't want to grow up having your children see um, their father constantly disrespect their mother and his marriage vows and think that that's okay. So I understand her mentality in doing so. But um, I'm grateful, you know, that she shared everything with us on her journey. Not everything. I'm glad that she, you know, is keeping some things to herself in regards to her divorce. Um, and I can see, you know, some evolution there in Cardi B. Like I can see her growth and her progression throughout the years. But yeah, congratulations to her. I'm really glad that she's putting herself first, especially, you know, now that she's carrying her third child. The last thing you want to do is be stressed out, you know, um, trying to bring another life into this world. So I want her to focus on, you know, her baby, her own mental health. I hope that she has a really strong support system around her. I know her mother and her sister are, um, she's close with them. And I'm hoping that they can just support her during this difficult time. You know, like I don't want her to internalize any of his negative behavior, right? Because stepping out on your marriage or any relationship, right? Um, that's a choice and that has nothing to do with your partner because uh, nobody can force you to cheat on another person. You know, when people say, you know, oh, I could take your man or I can, you know, take your lady or do that. No, you can't take someone who has enough character and has enough integrity within themselves to not cheat on their spouse, right? If you're that unhappy, then leave, you know, sit down, have an honest conversation, um, say, you know, this isn't working out and leave before you cheat. But it takes, again, a, a um, a certain level of maturity in order to do that, to have a real life conversation. Um, I don't know if, you know, Offset is there yet. I'm hoping that he will get there one day. Maybe not, you know, some men never grow up. But listen, Cardi's pregnant, you know what I mean? She is a mother of two and a half, <laughs> right? And the best thing that she needs to do right now is to focus on her own well-being, her, you know, holistic well-being. So that's definitely, you know, she's cutting dead weight and getting rid of one of her stressors, which is good. The last thing you need is a man stressing you out while you're trying to, you know, carry his seed. How just, how heartbreaking though, you know, how disrespectful. Like, man, this woman you know, became your wife and now she's carrying your child and you're stepping out with her on her, I mean, consistently. That's just, yeah. That's inexcusable. I'm glad she's doing what she needs to do. And I hope that, you know, going forward, she can find someone who will, you know, treat her well, right? Not just for the fame or the money, but actually sees her as a as a woman as a human being as a mother as an artist um but loves her for for her you know too many people are, are so caught up on in superficial nonsense right but i feel like cardi is looking for something real um most of us are and unfortunately for her though with fame comes a lot a lot of like vultures you know people who get into relationships for the wrong reasons so again i hope that she has not only her mother and her sister but some really good close friends that can give her sound dating advice when it comes to trying to find your significant other someone with you know maybe not even in the entertainment industry you know maybe like a businessman somebody who's a professional you know i love to see her with like a doctor or a lawyer or someone who, you know, carries himself with 
class and elegance and really is going to support her and her children and be a role model for her children and be, you know, a support system for her. Because Offset, unfortunately, it sounds like he just has a, a lot of growing up to do, you know, and he might not be there in his early 30s, but come, you know, his 40s and 50s, hopefully he will get there and he'll look back and he'll be like, yeah, I really messed up. Um, and that's, unfortunately, a song that is a song that plays well too often, right? I feel like a lot of times midlife crises <laughs> hit a lot of men and women um, just a little bit too late in life and they look back with regret. So the last thing you want to do is, you know, hurt the ones who you really love and who love you, right? Especially if this woman is carrying your child. But congratulations again to Cardi B. I wish her all the best, you know, health, wealth, success, love, happiness. I'm glad that she is putting herself first and caring for her unborn child and doing what she needs to do to move forward. So with that being said, you guys let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Please be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will talk with you in the next one. Take care of yourselves, aces. Bye.